Hey folks, welcome to another riveting episode of Military Forces Unleashed. Today we're diving deep into the D-45 class destroyer, a vessel that has become a significant part of the Royal Navy's arsenal. Strap in as we uncover the secrets behind this formidable ship. The story of the D-45 class begins in the late 1990s, a period marked by significant shifts in naval warfare. The Royal Navy, recognizing that its aging fleet of Type 42 destroyers was becoming obsolete, initiated a project to develop a new class of destroyers. The goal was straightforward yet ambitious, create ships equipped with cutting-edge radar and missile systems capable of countering contemporary threats. This was not just a simple upgrade, it was a leap into the future. The Type 45 or D-45 class was conceived with air defense as its primary role. The design phase was filled with challenges and high expectations as the Royal Navy sought a vessel that could seamlessly integrate with allied forces and operate in various theaters of war. Northrop Grumman and other contractors were brought in to push the boundaries of naval engineering and technology. By 2009, the first of these ships, HMS Daring, was launched. The D-45 class was touted as the vanguard of the Royal Navy surface fleet, promising to deliver unmatched air defense capabilities. The project, although delayed and over budget, was driven by the need to maintain naval superiority in an era of rapid technological advancements and evolving threats. These ships were designed to be modular, allowing for future upgrades and adaptability this was a critical consideration given the fast-paced nature of technological developments. The D-45 class was not just a replacement, but a reinvention of the destroyer concept, aimed at addressing both present and future challenges in naval warfare. The D-45 class destroyers feature a sleek, angular design focused on function over form. This minimalist approach minimizes radar cross-section, significantly enhancing stealth capabilities. It's not about looking pretty, it's about not being seen, these ships are like ghosts on the ocean, designed to evade detection and strike when least expected. At the heart of these ships lies the Samson radar, an integral part of the Sea Viper missile system. This radar can track hundreds of targets simultaneously, ensuring that nothing sneaks by unnoticed. Whether it's enemy aircraft, missiles, or even small, fast-moving boats, the Samson radar has it covered. This level of situational awareness is crucial in modern naval warfare where threats can come from any direction and at any time. The Sea Viper missile system, armed with Aster missiles, complements the radar's tracking capabilities with its precision in engagement. These missiles are designed to intercept and destroy a wide range of aerial threats, from high-speed jets to ballistic missiles. The D-45 class can defend itself and allied ships in a fleet, providing a protective umbrella against airborne attacks. This design philosophy reflects the Royal Navy's understanding of contemporary naval threats. It's about staying one step ahead, using technology to gain an edge over adversaries. The D-45 class isn't just built to survive modern warfare, it's built to dominate it. Let's talk firepower. The D-45 class is armed to the teeth with the Sea Viper missile system, a cornerstone of its formidable arsenal. This system includes both Aster-15 and Aster-30 missiles, designed for short and long-range engagements, respectively. Whether it's an enemy aircraft at close quarters or a ballistic missile screaming in from the horizon, the Asters have it covered. These missiles can maneuver at high speeds, making them adept at taking down agile, fast-moving targets. But the firepower doesn't stop there. The D-45-class destroyers also pack a punch with Harpoon anti-ship missiles. These aren't your garden variety projectiles, they're designed to sink enemy vessels with deadly precision. Capable of striking targets over the horizon, the Harpoons give the D-45 class a significant reach in naval battles. They're the maritime equivalent of a sniper's bullet, and they can turn the tide in a ship-to-ship -ship confrontation. To round out its armament, the D-45 is equipped with a 4.5-inch Mark VIII naval gun. This isn't just for show, it's a versatile piece of artillery capable of engaging both surface and land targets. Whether supporting ground troops with naval gunfire or taking on smaller boats that get too close for comfort, the Mark VIII is a reliable and effective tool. It's the kind of multi-role weapon that can adapt to the ever-changing demands of modern combat. 
This combination of missile systems and naval artillery ensures that the D-45 class can handle any threat thrown its way. It's not just about offense, it's about creating a layered defense capable of protecting itself and its allies. From intercepting incoming missiles to launching strikes against distant targets, these destroyers are always ready for action. The technology on board the D-45 class is nothing short of cutting edge. At the core of its advanced systems is the Integrated Electric Propulsion IEP, system. This isn't just a fancy engine setup, it's a game changer. By generating electricity to power both propulsion and onboard systems, the IEP offers a quieter and more efficient power source. This translates to enhanced stealth, as noise reduction is crucial for avoiding detection by enemy submarines and surface ships. Beyond propulsion, the D-45 class boasts some of the most advanced electronic warfare systems in the naval world. These systems are designed to detect, deceive, and disrupt enemy sensors and communications. In an age where electronic attacks are as common as missile strikes, the D-45's resilience against such threats is invaluable. The ship can jam enemy radars, spoof incoming missiles. The D-45 class also features a sophisticated combat management system, integrating data from various sensors and weapon systems into a coherent picture of the battlefield. This allows for rapid decision-making and precise targeting. The ship's radar systems, including the Samson and S-1850M radars, provide long-range surveillance and tracking capabilities, essential for early threat detection and response. Moreover, the ship's design includes modularity, allowing for future upgrades and adaptations. This means the D-45 class can incorporate new technologies as they become available, ensuring it remains relevant in the ever-evolving landscape of naval warfare. From advanced propulsion to cutting-edge electronic warfare and future-proofing through modularity, the D-45-class destroyers are a testament to the Royal Navy's commitment to staying ahead of the technological curve. While the focus is often on combat capabilities, the crew's well-being is not overlooked. The D-45-class features modern living quarters, complete with recreational facilities and comfortable accommodations. This focus on crew comfort is crucial for maintaining morale during extended deployments. The design reflects an understanding of the demands placed on naval personnel in high-stress environments. Each crew member has access to amenities that would make even the longest deployments bearable. There's a gym for physical fitness, essential for maintaining health and stress relief. The mess halls are designed to serve nutritious meals, keeping the crew well-fed and energized. Moreover, the D-45 includes state-of-the-art communication systems, allowing crew members to stay in touch with their families and loved ones back home. Since their introduction, D-45-class destroyers have been deployed in various international missions, from anti-piracy operations off the coast of Somalia to providing air defense in the Persian Gulf, these ships have proven their worth in diverse combat scenarios. Their ability to adapt to different mission requirements showcases their versatility and strategic importance in the Royal Navy's fleet. Looking ahead, the D-45 class is not resting on its laurels. Planned upgrades include enhanced missile systems, improved radar capabilities, and integration of next-generation technology. These upgrades are designed to ensure that the D-45 class can counter emerging threats and continue to play a pivotal role in the Royal Navy's operations well into the future. In conclusion, the D-45 class destroyer is not just a ship, it's a symbol of the Royal Navy's commitment to innovation and defense. With its advanced technology, formidable armament, and proven combat record, the D-45 class stands as a testament to British naval engineering. These ships embody the essence of modern naval warfare, combining stealth, power, and versatility in a single platform. Each time a D-45 class destroyer cuts through the waves, it serves as a reminder of the relentless pursuit of excellence that defines the Royal Navy. These vessels are equipped to handle a wide range of threats, from air and missile attacks to surface engagements, showcasing the adaptability and strength of British maritime strategy. Beyond their technological capabilities, the D-45 class also represents the dedication and professionalism of the crews who serve on them. The thoughtful design that includes modern living quarters and recreational facilities speaks to a broader understanding of what it takes to maintain a ready and resilient force. So, the next time you see one of these sleek destroyers patrolling the seas, remember that it's not just a vessel of war. It's a guardian of maritime interests worldwide. From the deterrence of potential adversaries to the protection of global shipping lanes, the D-45-class destroyer plays a crucial role in maintaining the balance of power on the high seas. 
and as long as these ships are in service, the legacy of British naval excellence will continue to sail strong. Thanks for joining us on this journey through the high-tech world of the D-45 class destroyer. If you enjoyed this video, give it a thumbs up, share it with your friends, and don't forget to subscribe to Military Forces Unleashed for more in-depth looks at military technology. See you next time.